So the volume calculator. So what we're going to do next is we want to take um, your income and figure out what's the required sales volume. What do you have to sell to make that much money? So I'm using an example of $150,000 and I want to walk through like how much real estate do you need to sell to make 150 grand. In this example, we're assuming that there's an 80-20 brokerage split and that you have a 2.5% commission on average. Sometimes you take a 3% listing, but let's just say it all averages out to 2.5%. On this line, what I've done is um, the very bottom of the equation, we multiply the 2.5%, which is your average commission, times the 80%, that's the part of your brokerage split that you keep. So that 2.5% times 80% comes out to 2%, right? Next, we're going to take your goal income, which is 150,000, we're going to divide it by 2%, and that gives you 7.5 million. So if you're at a, taking it back, if you're at a brokerage where your split's 80-20, and you sell, you know, about $7.5 million in real estate per year, then you should earn $150,000. The one problem with that uh, equation is that it assumes that you don't have any cost of sales. That doesn't factor in things like you probably have a transaction coordinator. You for sure have to pay a photographer. You have all sorts of marketing costs, sign companies, admin fees. Um, again, rough rule of thumb, play with this when you get home. A good rule of thumb is that you have roughly a 30% cost of sale as a real estate agent. So for every dollar you make, about 30 cents of that goes out the door in expenses. You have to pay to run a business, right? So it means you keep about 70 cents on the dollar, roughly. So what we have to do is we have to say again, okay, if I want to make 150 grand, then I need to take the volume from above 7.5 million, and you actually have to increase that by 30% because those expenses are going to come off the top, right? So that's what this formula does down here. It takes 7.5 million, that's our number from the very top here. We're multiplying it by 130% and you get 9.75 million. So you basically have to sell $10 million you chop 30% off for expenses, and then you're left with 150 grand, pay the tax ban. Those expenses are deductible. And so they would affect your taxes. They would actually benefit you on the tax side. So you're right, that is, um, this is gonna overestimate what you have to earn because you can deduct those expenses on your taxes. You end up making more money. So a couple of quick tips tax-wise, track your miles. Um, if you're not doing that right now, you're losing out on like 55, 56 cents per mile. Drive a thousand miles in a month. What is that? Like $560? It's crazy, right? Any type of, um, you know, pens and office supplies, all that stuff you want to keep good track of. Work with a good CPA on that stuff.